Hello everyone, welcome back to Hotline Topics. You back actor Latif Adedimeji surprises fans with a charming video today as he celebrates his birthday. He dedicates the special song to God today and he has taken to the social media platform not only to announce but also to celebrate. And this famous actor who has been counting down by uploading different photos. In a post Latif shared on his social media platform that he was doing on Latif was done in an all-white outfit with dyed brown hair and jewelry as he sang with all his heart, highlighting and appreciating the things God has done for him. And he says, Alhamdulillah, today is my birthday, the day I came into this world, and my heart is full of nothing but gratitude. Thanking Almighty Allah for yet another year of my life. May this day bring happiness, endless joy, blessings, opportunities, peace and serenity all the days of my life. Above all, Praying for a healthy, wealthy, and lucky life ahead. Happy birthday, Abdul Latif Adedimeji Adetola. And he also performed the song Shemi Lori. And he has also released several pictures. And he added that I just want to say a big thank you to God for his love and grace over me. Happy birthday to me. His grace is sufficient and I'm grateful. I seek and ask for your grace and mercy, Baba Luke. Happy birthday to me. Of course, a lot of celebrities have been wishing Latif Adedimeji a happy birthday. People like Bim Boshin, Itzele, Biola Adibayo, Yabo Ujo, and of course, almost all Yoruba actors and actresses, and a host of Latif Adi Dimeji, Adetola's fans. And yes, we are also joining in to say happy birthday to this amazing actor, Latif Adi Dimeji, Adetola. And may God bless your new age. Please stay with us if you want to know more about the biographical facts of this celebrant, Latif Adi Dimeji. This popular Yoruba actor has become one of the most sought-after actors we have in the Yoruba movie industry, where he's winning awards back to back. He was born, he was born on February 1 in 1985 in Oshu, the Lagos State. So he is today 35 years old. Latif Adid Image studied mass communication in Olabi Sonobanjo University, or Yunagowe, Ogun State. Over the years, Latif has backed many awards, including 2016 Best on Hollywood Awards for Best Actor in the Lead Yoruba. 2015 Best on Hollywood Awards for Best Actor in the Major Yoruba, City People Entertainment Awards for 2016 Best Supporting Actor of the Year Yoruba, Heritage Award in Atlanta for Best Actor Award for his role in Kudi Kleto, or do a Movie Award for Best Actor Award in 2014 and 2015 respectively, City People Movie Award for Best Actor of the Year Yoruba 2018, among others. And in September 2020, this popular actor emerged victorious after he was recognized as the Male Actor of the Year by Fresh Awards in 2020. And he was nominated alongside other top stars like Oduna Adekola, Femi Adebayo, Kunle Afford, Damola Latunji, and Muyuwa Adimola. He actually started with dance when he joined the entertainment industry, but he later realized that he could put a lot of effort into acting as well. So when he was with the NGO in secondary school, they taught him a lot about acting. He started acting not because he wanted to emulate anybody. It is something that he's passionate about and he enjoys doing it, whether he's being paid or not being paid for it. Joy radiates over Latif whenever he's acting. Since life is not all about having words, it is also about doing something that one finds peace and joy in doing. His mom already knew that he wanted to be an actor, but his dad didn't. His father didn't even know that he was a dancer to start with because he was doing it in the background. By the time his father knew about it, it was already late. Eventually, his dad realized that he found more joy in acting than doing any other work. So he left him to pursue his acting career. And today, he's proud of him. Also, this young man revealed that before he took acting full-time, he tried to work in the office for about two weeks. He had to resign, so it's just not working. Latif is the first born in a family of six. He studied mass communication, as mentioned earlier, and he attended his primary and secondary schools in Lagos State. It was in secondary school that he joined an NGO organization, Community Life Project, where he acquired the skills to act and write. He has been on stage since the age of 15, but started acting professionally in the year 2007. He landed his first major role in Kudi Klepto, which was produced by Yowande Adekoya Abiodo. It was this movie that shot him into the limelight, and his career has grown rapidly since then. Latif is also one of the versatile actors we have in Nigerian entertainment industry. He has a lot of characters as well, different characters that he showcases on his social media platforms. And he said that he took his time to build characters over the years before fame came. He also revealed in an interview that you can't wear or stay in one character for a long time. People will get bored. 
I would want to see you in another character. So Lativa has built enough characters that can last him for another 30 years in the industry. As soon as one character is out of touch, he switches into another character. So he revealed that if an actor has about five characters that can stand the test of time, then that actor is going to remain relevant for a very long time. So Latif took his time in building himself on a lot of characters because he realized that when fame comes, he might get a little bit busy. One of Latif Adid Image's popular character is Yakbeju, a middle-aged Yoruba woman. He started his training back in secondary school as mentioned earlier. When the NGO would visit schools to pick some of the best students, they would take them to the organization for proper training. At the time, getting information across to the grassroots people was always a difficult task. So this NGO would go to secondary schools pick the students and train them like on 18 different topics. They would then make them go through these topics to become a peer educator and counselor. So that was where it all started for Latif. From that time on, he built a passion for affecting people. It was not the acting per se, but the fact that he was able to impact knowledge in others at a young age. After leaving high institution, Latif produced his very first movie and he featured great actors in that movie. Actors like Inka Koji, Feti Abalogun, the late Buki Ajayi, Bisi Komalafe, and Joshua Ujo. He also revealed in an interview that it, has or not, it had not always been used. At first, it was not even paid at all. And even for Elijo, it was paid like 4,000 Naira. He wasn't getting the money back then. But he stayed true it all and didn't give up because of the passion he had for the job. And even for another one, it was paid like 10,000 Naira, 15,000 Naira until he got his big break. So how did he manage with such poor fees at the beginning? Well, he said he remembers that he would go back home to ask his father and his mother for money. And they would ask him that what had been and they would ask him that what had he been doing on location for weeks if he was not going to get paid. At that time they were expecting him to be taking care of his younger siblings. But he was just there asking their money for transportation to locations. Things finally changed and turned around for Latifa Didimiji. Immediately, he hit the limelight. He started getting massive roles and better pays and a lot of mouth watching endorsement deals. And for him, when he was asked if he knew he was going to become a popular actor, he revealed that he wasn't particular about being popular because he realized that when you run after fame, fame would run away from you. However, he kept training and upgrading himself so that when fame comes, he will be prepared. Those are the values that his parents instilled in him. And for the challenges he faced, and for the challenges he faced, he said there were lots of them. But every challenge has been more of a driving force for me. Whenever I face obstacles, I'm usually not scared. I see all my difficult times as a learning process. But when I'm praised, I get scared on how to improve so that I don't drop to a lower level. There were challenges of people accepting and rejecting me. Sometimes people even rubbish my works. I used to speak bad English at that time, and I still do sometimes. So I had to go to a speech class when I had to do a stage performance. I knew I had H factor, and I needed to work on it because I was going to be speaking all through in English. All that made me go off for three months. I was off work, and the stage play came out well. So this is a little bit about Latif Ade Dimeji's biographical fact as he celebrates his birthday today and dedicates a special song to God as he turns a year older. Happy birthday once again to Latif Ade Dimeji.